desert sand don't ask questions It don't wonder where I've been It understands it's my obsession To come and go with the wind I try and live the way I oughta Hey, hey, good day guys! Kimmy Russ Adventures here! We're at Alveston at the moment, aren't we, sweetie? We are! And we're going to go up through to Forth, up through the back roads, through to Devonport, through Forth and Turner's Beach, aren't we, babe? We are, it's well, about seven kilometres away. Forth. For, forth is, yes, and then on from there through to Devonport. As you see, we've just turned off the highway, that's the highway there on the left. It's absolutely beautiful day, winter's day today, isn't it, babe? Almost spring, I think spring has already sprung. What's your temperature? Uh, 12 degrees, babe, but look, the sun's out. No. <laughs> the sun is out, sweetie. It is. The sun is out, we're on the bikes, what more could you ask for? Yep, maybe a bit of food. Oh, yeah, right, okay. <laughs> That goes with biking, don't it? It does. Drinking and eating. That's why we're so bloody fat. Hey! <laughs> uh, not enough exercise. Exercise, bending the elbow. Oh yes, we do that a lot, don't we? We do. This road here that we're on now, you can see the highway on the left there. The road we're on now used to be the old highway, didn't it, babe? Once upon a time. Don't know, I didn't venture out oh. this far much. <laughs> oh, didn't you? No. Oh, you've led a sheltered life. I have, until I got the bikes. Until you got the bikes. <laughs> <laughs> this is Turner's Beach out this way, just past Olveston, in between Olveston and Devonport. Bath is where they usually have the Blues Festival. It is, yes. Every year they have Every a Blues year. Festival, that's right. Not a bad little area this is, babe. Some nice houses out here. It's only a few kilometres from um, Alveston, so they haven't got far to go to the shops and that. There's a little shop up here on the right, I think. Yeah, and a servo, isn't it? Go to Cradle Mountain up through this way. You can do, yeah. Go up through Wilmot Way, can't you? Yep. It's it very cold up that way. Is it cold today? My fingertips are a little bit chilly. <laughs> uh, and I have my glove liners on. Oh, do you? I've got to toughen you up before we go to the mainland. I don't have to worry about that mainland where there's a lot better than here. No, but if we go the Alpine way. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's up through the mountains. It's but gonna be a bit chilly. That time of the year's not too bad though, is it November? Well, she still gets cold. It's a bit like Tassie. As you can see, a lot of lush farming area through here. A lot of vegetables growing through this area, isn't there, babe? A lot up of yeah. Up fourth, fourth side, as they call it, up here a bit further. They grow a lot of cows too. Do they? Yep. As long as those cows stay in the paddock and don't wander out on the road, we'll be right. <laughs> Alright, they'll be right. They won't get hit by a Harley. Oh, Jesus. I, I couldn't think of anything more embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the poor cow would have to hang its head in shame. Yeah. He wasn't quick enough to beat a fucking Harley. <laughs> uh, shouldn't have got me started. No, I know, I put my foot in it every yeah. time. Right, just up around the corner here is the heart of Forth, isn't it? Yep. A suburban metropolis, isn't it, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I think they've one shop here. <laughs> and, right. there, and there's a pub, more importantly, there's a pub. Yeah. <laughs> Pub's the biggest place in, in the So, down Amanda of Dyna Madness, if you ever come to Tassie and go to Forth, you can camp here, yep. over at the uh, football ground here, and you've got a pub on your back door. They don't allow heaters though. No, they don't allow heaters. No power. <laughs> <laughs> These are the main drag of Forth, isn't it, babe? It is. There's not much here. One servo, one pub. Yeah. That's a servo there, a fellow rider pulling up. He got a quacker, one of their messes, Vulcan S's, yeah. aren't they? Is that what they're know. called? Vulcan S, yeah, that's one of their messes. Yeah. Yeah, Vulcan S, is it? Yeah. Anyway, there's the pub. And like we said, they have a blues festival here, just over to the left, over the back of that river there, there's a football ground. And that's where they have it at, isn't it? It is. It's a quaint little town. I'll tell you though, when the 4th Music Festival is on, the Blues Festival, it is fairly packed. 
this is a nice little way to go through to Devonport in instead of the bloody highway. Taking the back roads. On the back roads. And you've got Harvest Moon up here as well. Yeah, vegetable processing plant, isn't it? It is. A lot of carrot, carrots and everything growing up around this way. A lot of veggies, but yeah, a lot of carrots and that as well. Must be good land for it, babe. Yeah, I reckon. As you can see, it's a rich brown soil. Must be getting that ready to put something in there. Yeah, and plowed her up, haven't they? All the yeah. summer crops will be going in, or if not, they're in already, some of them. What are those ones on the left? Cabbages? Cauliflowers, aren't they, babe? Yeah, cauliflowers. Yeah, Look at these stunning views, isn't it? Look at that. Like I said, we're heading over to Devonport, up through this way. This stretch should be parallel with Lilico Road, I reckon. Yeah, the way we go now is Lilico Strait, yeah, yeah, is parallel with the highway. Highway's over to the left there, about a kilometre over to the left. Maybe a bit more. So Darren of Dinah Madness and Amanda, they've moved into a new house, haven't they both? They have. And they're getting a the bar ready. I'll tell you what, we might have to drop in there and go to that bar yeah. because he said the frothies will be cold very soon. Yeah. That sounded like an invite to me. Oh, it sounded like an invite to me. If someone tells me they got cold beer, yeah. or cold grog, I'm there. Yep. I'm there. I think um I think Darren um Darren, Darren's partner I mean that she's got a V-Strom like mine. I think she needs a givey tank bag, babe. For her makeup. For her makeup, yes, for a makeup bag. Now Darren, you've got a tank bag for your bike. You buy her a givey tank lock bag, she can store all her makeup in it. She could look beautiful for you, couldn't you, babe? Not that hey? she doesn't talk. No, that's right, but while she's on the road. She can apply it. She won't be scared of going on the camera then, will she? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's the reason she's scared of going on the camera. I oh, know. We know what you women are like. Once you've got helmet <laughs> hair, you don't like that camera pointing at you. Yeah. Splurge and spend some money, for Christ's sakes, Darren. She'll love you for it. Won't you, babe? I don't know if it makes you love them anymore. Oh, yeah, no, you'd rather me buy stuff for your bike than you, wouldn't you? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yep. Valentine's Day presents. I remember my Valentine's Day present a couple of years ago. Yes. That was the pipes for my sporty. Yes, the pipes for your sporty, the Vance and Hines slip-ons, weren't they? Yeah. Make a cackle a bit. I was more excited about getting that than the engagement ring. <laughs> yeah, well, this is it all, don't it, eh? <laughs> and she wants to get married. Well, that, that there, I, you probably just missed it, but that was the Don River Railway we just come past. Kim was talking. Sorry. This is up through the Don here. This is coming up through to Devonport now. Not far away at all industrial area this area isn't it now if we went left here at this roundabout we'd go into Devonport but we're going to go straight ahead because someone's hungry we're going to the homemakers center yes we're going McDonald's. to the homemakers oh wait is it subway oh fuck that shit that's healthy <laughs> <laughs> i'm going to Maccas. yeah <laughs> anyway there's another bar talk coming out in the next couple of weeks, the next few weeks. And there's going to be a competition in this one as well, isn't there, babe? Yep. Another competition and another prize for someone to win. So we'll have that coming out very soon. You'll have to watch it to find out. And how to enter. Not long before we go away, is it, babe? Yeah. I think it's 68 days on my countdown. Yeah. I think it's 68, I don't know about that anyway, before we leave this great isle of Tassie and we head off to the mainland, don't we babe? Cruising for, oh, I don't know, a month? Uh, four, a month. not quite four weeks, yeah. We're over there for, I think we're over there for about 25 days or something, 26 days or something. Can't wait. Mm, gonna be fun. Look out, everyone that knows is on the mainland. They'll be locking their doors. They'll be locking their fucking doors and going on holidays, won't they, babe? Yeah. I'll just phone ahead, tell, tell my daughter, carton in the fridge, get it cold. Yep. Failed last year, didn't she, babe? Eh? And then she used the excuse, hey, you turned up a day early. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, 
But you should know, have that carton ready. Debbie had ours ready. Debbie had it ready. She had a carton in the fridge for us. For us a sister. Yes. Amber. We've got people in nearly every state. Well, not quite, but... If there's anyone in New South Wales or South Australia that wants some lodges for a day or two, yeah. <laughs> we're open. Anyway, we're pulling up now at the Homemaker Centre, aren't we, babe? We're not pulling up yet. We no, we're we about to. We're pulling in, OK? We'll go straight ahead. I can see the golden arches. So I reckon this is where we'll end our vlog for the day. Look at that. And we come here on lunchtime too, haven't we? What's the time? Yep, lunch time. Lunch time, should we fall? Must have been if you're starting to talk about food. Anyway, yeah. we'll sign off. This is Kimmy Russ Adventures. We'll catch you on the road somewhere else. Remember guys, dream till your dreams come true. See you guys, watch that car. Watch that car. Yeah. I couldn't last another day. I'm only happy on the high.